Welcome to this GEM Motoring Assist video on the challenges of driving in winter conditions. And the winter doesn't get much more spectacular than this, does it? We're in Finland, where there's snow as far as the eye can see, and the temperature is several degrees below freezing. Of course, extreme winter conditions are something many of us have to deal with only very occasionally. But when the snow hits, it's guaranteed to bring the whole road network to a standstill. Anyone keen to perfect their driving skills in the winter really needs to get out there on the snow and ice to appreciate how the whole system of driving dynamics changes instantly. Watching a short video on the subject won't make experts of any of us. But what we can do when we have the advantage of all this empty space is to take a look at what can happen if we overdo it on a bend or perhaps have to react suddenly to something that's occurred in front of us. It's all about time and space, and you really need plenty of both when you're on the road in winter. Stopping distances can increase up to tenfold, grip on snow and ice is often greatly reduced, and if you are driving, it's vital that you do everything slowly. Plan ahead. Where are you likely to lose grip? Where might you be in danger of being hit by something else? And are you going into that bend too quickly? Let's turn our attention now to skidding, which is a major cause of concern for many drivers, especially in winter. And because prevention is better than cure, let's look at the steps we can take to ensure we don't get involved in a skid in the first place. Skids happen for a number of reasons. They can include uh, harsh acceleration, harsh braking and steering and there's uh, features on a vehicle that can help you. Basically, whatever, you, whatever you've got on board can't reverse the laws of physics. In winter, you can greatly reduce your risk of skidding by being aware of changing road conditions and adjusting your driving. So steer more gently, brake more gently, accelerate more gently, avoid harsh movements and slow down. Driving on snow and ice is a completely different and challenging experience. OK, now it might be fine here in a sterile area as used by the Finnish police, but the reality is that driving on the open road in conditions like this bring drivers and other road users one step closer to trouble, however highly they rate themselves. Here's our checklist before any winter journey. Check all lights are in working order. Make sure your number plates are clearly visible from the front and rear. Check tyre pressures and check you have plenty of tread depth. Check that wiper blades are not worn or damaged. Clean the windows inside and out and wipe the lamp lenses and door mirrors. Keep a can of de-icer and an ice scraper in the car. De-icer can also be used to defrost doors and petrol cap locks. Carry a few extra items with you on winter journeys. Gloves, a blanket, a small shovel, a torch and some cash could all prove very useful. Well, rather than run the risk of something like that happening, if the forecast threatens snow or ice, it makes sense to reduce your risk, postpone your journey. 